So I wasn't going to vlog today um, because I was just going to get an Instagram video done and this is like a perfect vloggable moment where this happens all the time. I will try out a new makeup product and it completely ruins my makeup and I have to end up with nothing to show for the day. These Huda Beauty Melted Duos have always sucked for me and I don't know why I thought that I was going to be able to make one work. It literally mixes with powder shadow and creates like the most disgusting muddy mess on your eyelid. This is literally not savable, so I'm pissed. This is one of the things that pisses me off most, um, is when I try to get work done and I can't. Uh, so I'm going to take my makeup off and forget about social media and go to the gym. This is all of the HelloFresh meals that we've had. Tons of them. Hey guys, today is Tuesday. I had a really like messed up day yesterday. It just did not go my way. Um, so today I have to kind of make up for it even though I do work a long shift tonight at work I'm gonna try to get as much done this morning as I can I need to sit down film that Instagram tutorial that I failed yesterday and get some emails done But first I want to show you the mask I'm gonna use when my skin is really acting up and just not feeling itself I use this origins retexturizing mask with rose clay. It's literally the best mask that I have in my collection It is like the best for even skin and just like drawing everything out of my pores so I'm gonna wash my face and apply this while I finish up my hair but yeah this week is not gonna be the most eventful week of my life but that's okay I'm just gonna get work done and see where it takes me Hey guys, it is Thursday. I needed to hop on here and tell you that I took a mental health day yesterday. Sometimes when I work non-stop, like seven days a week, I need to like stop before I hit a wall. Um, so I told myself yesterday I will do absolutely nothing for social media and I pretty much didn't. I posted a couple things to like Snapchat and Instagram, but I did not film, I did not edit, and it's exactly what I needed. It's kind of crazy because even when doing little vlog snips here and there, um, you guys still aren't really seeing everything that I do all day. I want to get there, but believe me, there is a lot. But anyways, today I do plan on making up for yesterday. It is a filming day for YouTube, so I have two to three videos that I would like to get done today. So basically, I am just doing my hair and a little bit of eye makeup, and both or two videos that I want to film are primer and foundation related, so I'll hop on camera and show the process. One of them is on that package back there, the Wet n Wild Dewy Foundation. Yeah, I'm going to wrap this up before I procrastinate my filming day any further. So I just got done filming my foundation review of the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Dewy Foundation. I don't know what I'm going to do with the shades yet. A lot of the times when I have a package like this with all of the shades in a collection, I like to kind of hoard them and then donate them to a women's shelter because I feel like women's shelters would appreciate like the base products sometimes more than like lipsticks and eyeshadows. I feel like complexion products and like mascara and stuff like that is more valuable. But I am so glad to have makeup on my face. I feel like I have hopped on this vlog many times looking like a naked mole rat this week um but this week is truly an example of how boring my life is i don't know if i'm always going to have something exciting to share with you guys and i don't know i just want to be open with you guys and honest sometimes things are boring and i swear every day i'm just doing dishes laundry filming working eating and sleeping and so it's hard to find like 
nice content to share with you guys. But I promise I'm gonna do my best and whenever I have something interesting to share, I will share it. <laughs> Hold that thought, I actually did wanna share something with the vlog. So this is like my filming setup, which is too formal, but I don't care. I'm just gonna share this with you guys. I wanted to show you this Allure beauty box. I wanted to show you guys what came in my January box. So there's a foaming cleanser from Caudalie. This is a giant full-size cleanser. It has moisturizing grape and purifying sage in it. There is the Tarte Lights Camera lashes mascara a full size this is the perfect shine oil mist color and heat protectant from nature lab there's a little philosophy sample it is the renewed hope in a jar water cream is this a sample or a full size this is a lip product it's a lip balm from a car it's a lip restoration that almost looks like a full size. I feel like this box is gonna be something to look out for because it's getting more and more popular and they did a collaboration with Carly Bible a couple months ago that I absolutely loved. We have a vitamin serum. It's called Vitabrid C12 Dual Drop Serum. And then we have a little sample of the Kate Somerville Exfolicate, which is an amazing exfoliator. So this box is $15 a month and I believe sometimes they do have it where you can get your first box for $10. So if you guys have happen to be interested in it I will leave the link in the description of this video so anyways my plan for the rest of today is to go to the gym it's one o'clock now I'm going to the gym around three I probably won't get done until like five because I feel so meh working out helps me feel better like nothing else like working out is my savior so I'm probably gonna be at the gym for a few hours just like completely work through how I'm feeling <laughs> and then I'm gonna come home make another hello fresh meal I don't know if I'm gonna share it with you guys or not I'm really getting my bearings with this whole vlogging thing um, but if you guys let me know what you want to see I will be happy to do it eventually I definitely want to share my workouts with you guys that's like something I've always wanted to do. I'm just not brave enough. <laughs> I've been doing CrossFit exercises and kind of modifying them a little bit with what I can do right now. Um, I looked them up on Pinterest. I'm not actually paying for CrossFit, um, but I recommend looking up workouts on Pinterest if you guys want to try some. If you're interested in a specific one that I have tried, look up the Fatal 40. It's one of my favorites and it takes a long time for me to get through it, but it's a really, really good one if you want to bust your ass at the gym. And yeah, that's the rest of my evening and I'm thinking maybe I will take you guys with me um, tomorrow if I do anything outside of my home. It's so weird hopping on the camera and like talking to you guys in my vlog versus talking to you guys on my main channel. I just did a check-in for the foundation review, just wrapped up that video. Um, I did just get done working out pretty hardcore at the gym. One thing that I'm dealing with that I'm not sure if it's what I have, but I feel like it is, is runner's-induced asthma or like... Um, exercise induced asthma I don't know anytime I run a distance over a mile or I sprint in tonight's case I sprinted um, I get this weird pain in my throat and like in my lungs they feel like they're burning but this isn't normal today it's very different it's like I have like it feels like a burning hole like a pinpoint of like sharp pain it's so weird and then I cough and then it goes away, but then like hours later I have to cough and have like a coughing fit again. I don't know, the internet doctors can diagnose me I guess, but I'm probably gonna have to go to my doctor if I want to continue to run in my workout regimen. But I just wanted to hop on here to tell you guys good night. I don't think I'm making a HelloFresh tonight because it is too late, it's 8 o'clock now and I don't know, my boyfriend's not home, I don't really feel like cooking, so I'm probably not gonna make one tonight. I'm just drinking this peace tea. Have you guys tried this? This is the peace tea snowberry. Just trust me. Like, if you're an adult who happens to love the flavor of Capri Suns, but there's not enough in a Capri Sun and you don't want to walk around drinking a Capri Sun, pick this up because it's like an adult version of Capri Sun. It's so, so good. <sighs> but yeah, that's it for tonight. I'm exhausted. I'm going to put away uh, the foundations from earlier try to be a little productive, maybe get my footage into Final Cut Pro to start editing the foundation review, take a shower, you know, all that good stuff, <laughs> and then that's it for tonight. Hey guys, it is Saturday, so this week was really uneventful for the vlog, and I'm so sorry for that. 
Um, yesterday I ended up having another day where I just mentally couldn't handle social media um, so I'm just being honest with you guys like sometimes that happens and it happened twice this week um, yesterday I really didn't do anything for social media I ended up going to work I think I can't remember if I failed a video or if I just didn't feel it in me um, but I ended up going to work and then I had a birthday party for one of my friends and so I was out all night last night um, and for whatever reason I decided to make a last-minute nail appointment um, with my nail guy at 10 in the morning which it's 9 20 right now I need to get going um, because I feel better when I'm more put together I don't know if any of you guys are like that but like especially for work in front of people which this is I know it probably sounds stupid but I have chipped nails and they're grown out so like I don't feel put together so I don't feel right when I'm like sitting down to film thankfully this new vlog channel gives me an outlet where I can sit down and post not caring what I look like at all um, but on the beauty channel and on my Instagram and short videos and stuff, it really bugs me when I've got like this, this going on, my little chipped nail. So I haven't decided what I want to get done, but that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to get my nails done. I'm going to edit. I do definitely need coffee more than anything, so I'm probably going to be a couple minutes late to my nail appointment. It is sleet and like kind of hail at the same time outside right now so I'm not gonna actually vlog while I'm driving because it just seems dangerous um, but I'm gonna head to Duncan and get my coffee and then I'm gonna go to my nail appointment so I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you know you know sometimes weeks like this don't go the way that I want them to go but hopefully you guys didn't mind this vlog either way I mean I'm just planning on showing real life and this week was not the most exciting but anyways I'll check in with you guys after I get my nails done I don't know how people do this because there's literally a truck of like full-grown men like two cars down from me wondering what the hell I'm doing right now I don't know if you guys can see this good it's like kind of blown out lighting but I got like a sheer pink like base coat with a little bit of silver glitter over top just something basic now I'm gonna head home I did get my coffee I got my large iced latte with mocha I'm kind of bored with Duncan's flavors to be honest with you I'm like waiting around for a new flavor to come out I liked the Christmas flavors but they're all gone now and I'm not like a massive fan of the Girl Scout cookie flavors that they have right now there used to be a flavor unless I'm making it up in my mind but it was coconut cream pie and it was so so good and now the only coconut flavor that they have is unsweetened coconut or coconut caramel which is good but it's not as good as the coconut cream pie that's in my memory but yeah this is probably my day today like I might go get groceries later on but that's about it I'm gonna edit probably and maybe clean my beauty room because it does need a little once over it's getting a little out of control if I do anything worth showing I'll fill you guys in a couple other things that went down this week um, my dog had to go to the vet and get an x-ray on Wednesday um, which is another reason why I didn't film that day or work that day um, but she had to get an x-ray because she's kind of limping a little bit but the x-ray didn't show anything that the vet could see so they sent it to a specialist and they said that they didn't see anything either so hopefully that means there's nothing major wrong with her but that was a little stressful because she is my baby but she is a little bit overweight technically she's not overweight but she is a big dog so she does need to go on a little bit of a diet um, and hopefully that helps her hips or joints or whatever's bothering her. But yeah, I'm getting stared at from a couple cars over, so I'm going to head home. <laughs> hey guys, it is Sunday, so I wanted to hop on here so that I could wrap up the vlog because I didn't really wrap it up yesterday. Um, I honestly have been feeling like I'm not good at this <laughs> over the past couple days because I have done a few things like going to Target and going to Walmart and like getting my groceries and stuff that I I suppose I could have vlogged like what I got and stuff which maybe I will start to do that but it's hard when I'm not sure who wants to be in my vlog yet but we'll get there today is gonna be kind of a chill day I have been reorganizing a closet in my beauty room which was absolutely a disaster I took a bag to donation that was like bigger than the back seat of my car um, how that stuff was in there I don't even know um, but right now I have like really ratchet storage bins in that closet that I would like to replace with actual shelving so at some point today I'm gonna go to Target and look up look for like some shelving units that I can put in there 
Um, it's not a pristine area of my house, so I personally don't like showing it. Um, but it's basically where I keep my foaming hand soap and my wallflowers from um, Bath and Body Works. I keep my beach towels in there and like some of my bags and all of my socks. So many socks that I have like a vault of them upstairs and the rest of them I have in my bedroom. But yeah, that's the plan for today. I'm also going to make some mini pizzas because I'm going to treat today like a little cheat day after I do my cardio. Um, I want to make English muffin pizzas, which if you guys have not made little pizzas on English muffins, please just trust me. They are so much better than bagels and a lot less carbs than bagels because bagels are so like thick. And the way that English muffins are, like the sauce just like sinks into them. It's so good. If I can get a clip of that for the vlog, then I will insert it because that's one thing I wanted to show you guys was my little English muffin pizzas. But I'm going to do that a little bit later on, probably before I go to Target. But I just wanted to thank you guys for watching because I think this might have been a little bit more boring than my last one. And also thank you for like allowing me to kind of do my trial phase of this vlog before I kind of get used to vlogging. Some goals that I have for this channel are to share with you guys my first home purchase when I finally do get there with my boyfriend. I want to show you DIYs. I want to share with you like my cleaning routines. I want to share with you my vehicle upgrade when I finally get another one. Um, just all sorts of things and I really don't want to hold back like I feel like I've done pretty well hopping on here not looking good which is something I've been trying to kind of break through my shell with but I want to just show you everything whether it be boring or not so if this was boring I'm really sorry it's been kind of an iffy week I had a few days where mentally I just couldn't really function and it just wasn't doing well and then some other days I was highly productive so it's been weird but anyways I'm gonna wrap it up here thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already give this video a thumbs up that helps push it out to the YouTube world and hopefully I will see you guys all in my next one bye